my channel. I'm super excited. Um, this is one week later, and um, so this is going to be my kind of skin repair follow-up. I don't know what to call this, but anyway. So basically, I did a few videos back. I did a video showing what happened to my skin, what I did to it, and then I've been kind of like following up. So I want to say today is technically like a week and like two or three days since that situation happened. So I am back. I want to show you guys my skin's progress. I must say I'm really excited and very impressed on how great my skin is looking. I'm going to pat myself on the back because I've been really consistent with my skincare and my cleansing and the products that I've been using. Um, and yeah, I mean, I have some makeup on today, but I was really like... I don't know, it's, I'm a makeup addict because I honestly this morning was like, you know what, I'm not going to wear anything because my skin is looking so good. So what I want to do is I'm going to go wash my face, come right back and kind of zoom in for you guys and show you guys what it's starting to look like at this point. Um, again, I'm really impressed. Now this is a makeup I had on today, very minimal, I just went to work. So I'm um, super minimal, I'm trying to keep it at a minimum just because... I'm still trying to repair my skin, um, so that's why I don't have that much, and I'm like, I, I haven't worn eyeshadow in about a week or so, so that tells you I'm really trying to refrain from wearing a lot of makeup. So I'm going to go wash my face, and I'll be right back. Okay, guys, so I am back. My face is fresh and clean and dry. Um, I wanted to show you guys exactly what it is that I'm using. The cleanser that I use is this Purity Made Simple, the ones that... <laughs> The One Step Facial Cleanser. This is what I've been using. Um, I got this. Like, it was a bundle at Sephora this past holiday. It was, like, a big deal. I think it was, like, $25, $30, and it brought, like, wipes and stuff. So I ended up getting this, and I really do like this. It is not abrasive on this skin, um, and it works well with a brush. Now, this is the Spin Spa. My mom gave me this as a gift, and it's so nice. Um, So... The brush is super soft. I mean, I know there's like really high-end ones, but I'm not trying to spend no high-end money. Like, I'm really not. When there are more inexpensive products that do just the same thing. So, my mom ended up getting me this as a set. It was like a kit, and it brings like the really long one for your body, for your ankles, for your knees, for your back, for all that good stuff. So, my neck, my back, that, no. Don't go there. Just don't, don't do it. Don't do it. So I've been using this um, head, it brings to, there's a stiffer one, this is the more soft one. It is extremely comfortable, very gentle on my skin. So I take my cleanser, rub it all over my face just to kind of break apart all that makeup, or that little bit of makeup that I had on. And then I wet my brush with warm water, and then I go at it and just kind of like brush all the makeup like off of my pores, my face and everything. I rinse my face, get all of that off, add a little bit more of that cleanser, all over my face but this time I do it with my hands scrub my face with the palms of my hands rinse that out and then pet dry my face I follow up with a moisturizer and I'm actually using this one right here this is the simple sensitive skin experts replenishing rich moisturizer this is like perfect for my skin because it's like getting really sensitive for some reason and then finally I go in with the ordinary azelaic acid um, suspension cream just a little bit goes a long way then I use the alpha arbutin I spoke about these in uh, a video I'll link it up here but um, and it uh, in that video I kind of tell you what it's supposed to do and stuff so um, I apply some of this and then I in the end apply some of the salicylic acid and this helps with the brightening and the lightening of the dark spots on my face. So now I'm gonna zoom you guys in and show you guys what the progress looks like. Um, if my face looks a little dry, my bad, but I literally just washed off all the makeup and I haven't even put my moisturizer on yet. I wanted to show you literally what everything looks like on my face before I apply my skincare products. Okay, up close and personal. So right now, this is what my forehead is looking like. It is completely flat, and I do have some dark spots, but nothing I can't work with, and a very light BB cream does cover that up. And then, and I have a mirror right behind where my camera is. I have a mirror back here. I have mirrors everywhere, so my bad. Um, I know I'm, like, looking everywhere. Um, and then, let's see. Everything is so much lighter. I have no bumps. In this area here, you can see this is where, like, the main 
damage, the main attraction, you know? Um, but the main damage did happen here. It is so much better. It is so much lighter. And I feel like the ordinary products have really been improving my skin's condition. Um, I've only been using them for a week. So I totally just go to work, come back, wash my face as soon as I get at home. And I do the skincare routine that I told you that I'm doing. Um, Cause I don't want to keep all that makeup on my face for longer periods of time. So I apply all those products and I feel like I'm, since I'm doing it every single day, I think, I think that's what's helping my skin. Over here, this was like super patchy and dry skin and really, really dark. It is so much lighter. But the part that really got to me was this here because it literally was raw and it was pink and it looked like a burn mark. And now it doesn't. And my skin is looking clearer and more radiant. My under eyes are getting a little lighter, which means nothing because none of these products did any, any of that. Any of that. That means I've been sleeping, yes. But my skin is looking better and clearer and I'm so happy about that. So at this point, I am extremely curious to see what my skin is going to look like. And I'm sorry, I'm like Spanish, so I'm like, <sighs> I use my hands a lot. But I'm really curious to see what my skin would look like in another week and a third week if all of this would completely clear off and I'd have like baby smooth, brand new skin or what. My skin is right now is just the way it was before I damaged it. If you guys want to see more progress and see like on a weekly if it gets any better and all these spots clear out, um, using the ordinary products, let me know. I'd be more than happy to continue to film um, weekly updates to see, maybe show you guys um, if all these dark spots do clear off with these products. Um, but yeah, I am so happy my skin is back to normal. I, once again, want to finally thank you guys for all the support, all the kind comments. You guys have been awesome. A lot of good feedback, a lot of good advice, a lot of good tips, skincare tips, which I will be putting into play. And I'm really grateful to have a community like you guys. I mean, honestly, my mother didn't even know that this had happened. I was so ashamed. I don't even know how I put my first video up on my skin because my mom found out by watching my video. She was like, what happened? She had to call me. So, I mean, I literally poured my heart out and showed you guys what I did before anyone in my family knew. And that means a lot because I feel like I've built a community um, of peers, not, not just followers, but you guys are my peers. So, I learn from you, you guys learn from me, we take each other's advice, we support each other, and I think that's completely awesome. So, I just want to you know, express my appreciation for you guys and all your support. Viewing my videos and um, just giving advice and stuff, I'm really, really thankful for that. And that is a wrap for this video. I'm gonna go edit it, put it up real quick and edit some other ones that I have. If you're new to my channel, don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you guys in my next video.